For number six, we're using the uh, polygon tools to make a new part. So let's go ahead and make a new sketch. And since these are bases, again, we're going to use the base plane. Uh, for the square, instead of rectangle, we're going to just use our four sided polygon. We'll use this as the base point. Let's use our vertical tool to make the sides go straight up and down. It says that the sides of this are 0.58 tall. And if we extrude this out, then the height is 0.32. There's then an ellipse on top of this. This is our center point. Let's take it out some distance. Looks like the uh, minor axis of the ellipse is 0.36. So half of that is put divided by 2, it's going to be 0.18. And then for the major axis, this is going to be 0.48 divided by 2, so 0.24. Extrude that, and the height of this is 0.12. The second half of number 6, we have to make a new part. And again, we're going to start with the base. This time it's a triangle. So for our polygon, we're going to type in 3. Let's have this point straight up. And it looks like the base of this triangle is 0.56. And the height of this is 0.34. There's a ellipse on top of this and it runs uh, the same direction as the main point let's kinda put that on there it looks like the uh, major axis is going to be 0.25 half of that is 0.125 or just put divided by 2 and your other side is half of 0.21 so that's 0.105 and we're extruding this up a distance of 0.19 okay so there's your two parts for part six you will need these to do a couple of steps on uh, exercise 5.5